You ever hear of butterfly pea flower tea? You ever wonder if it might be good for low carb keto or carnivore people? Hey there, NJRoot22.com here with another low carb keto carnivore chat. And today it's about this uh, product I found. It's called a butterfly pea flower or blue butterfly pea flower tea. Can't remember how I found it. I think it had something to do with some benefits, some health benefits, and it, it might have been low carb too. But I got it from um, Thailand. I bought it online. There's a link in the article here and in my blog post on njroot22.com. Uh, the coolest thing about this tea is, and I think this is the most fascinating thing, is that it's color changing tea. When you brew this, you get a little steeper thing. I forget what they're called, but I, this metal mesh thing, I shove a couple of these dried flowers into the mesh and I steep it for you know 10 or 20 minutes. And it's blue and you can see from the color here, it's blue. And this is not very good uh, picture because I steeped it for a long time. So it turned really dark blue. But you add some citrus juice, like lemon juice, for instance, and it turns purple. Woo! It's really cool. It's like a magic. And if, if you don't want to use it for its supposed health benefits, it's a fun mixer for drinks when you're making drinks. You know, I should have brought my drink out, but if I sometimes when I make my seltzers, I put a little splash of this in there, it makes them blue or purple. It's also fun to show your kids. Like, wow, how cool is that? It's neat on that aspect alone. Apparently, this, uh, I guess they can prove that this has uh, good vitamins and minerals such as calcium, magnesium, potassium, zinc iron, manganese, and sodium. I didn't put this in my show notes here, but I think this might be good to drink for a hangover as well. So if you ever have a hangover, I'm gonna try it tomorrow when I'm hungover. I'm gonna drink, I have one sitting in the fridge now. In fact, that's the picture you see in this video. I'm gonna drink it tomorrow morning, first thing. Instead of having my coffee, I'm gonna suck this uh, butterfly pea flower tea down. And apparently antioxidants. I have heard about antioxidants for a long time. I, I, has anybody ever proven that they work? I don't know. Here's what some of the benefits are. And they like, I'll, I'll rattle off a few here. Like the antioxidants, they can fight off free radicals. Also is apparently anti-inflammatory inflammations. I don't, I don't know. I guess if you're just bloated, I don't know. I have a swollen knee. And it's also supposedly supposed to help with fatigue. Like, and this is for people who are suffering from chronic fatigue. I don't have chronic fatigue, so I have no idea. Uh, it all has an analgesic property as well, pain relieving, and I, I really don't get pain either, so I don't know. It's also anti-diabetic. It's supposed to regulate blood sugar levels. If you're low carb or carnivore, you're not gonna need any anti-diabetic properties in anything. And it's also supposed to be good for stress and anxiety. If you're stressed out or if you have trouble sleeping, it's supposed to help you relax a little. Uh, I don't know about that as well. And if you're asthmatic, it's supposed to help with that. And also if you ever have a cold and it helps respiratory problems, which I think it might be something worth considering, considering this, uh, considering, considering uh, this whole big crisis that we're having now. It might be good to have if you get the flu this year. And they also say it's good for your hair and skin. I mean, we have nice hair and skin already. Uh, I don't know if it's just getting better or it's staying the same. Don't know. It's supposed to have a good effect on the stomach if you have an ulcer. Apparently, they use it to treat ulcers uh, worldwide. And I guess it's one of these uh, homeopathic or whatever, these uh, homemade things. I don't know. I think it's a neat drink. And I can't say if the, these claims that are made are true. They have studies out there and they, apparently they did it and it, they said it, uh, it worked. I don't know. It doesn't really have much taste. You have to add uh, lemon to it to have any taste. I just think it's fun to have, and if they're in the small chance that these things, these wonderful things they say about this tea are true, it's fun. I think I paid 15 bucks, I got three of these bags. It took a month to get them from Thailand, and I'm still on my first bag. It took ah, three, over three months. So like three bags will last you almost a year if you drink one, one or two uh, big things a day. So I, I think it's worth it. Give it a shot. I mean, you'll see the link in my, my article and, and below this video too. It's like 15 bucks. It'll last you a year it's, and it's a lot of fun. So if you like this video, please hit the bell and the subscribe and look at our other videos and I'll see you next time.